Hi, my name is Maria and this is my science experiment. My science experiment is on using alka seltzer to demonstrate the law of conservation of matter. First, here are our materials. A metal spoon, a nine inch balloon, a round bowl or dish, six alka seltzer tablets, a water bottle, a scale, and a measure. You have to use a measuring cup to measure two cups of water. First, we're going to measure the two cups of water and see how it weighs. And this weighs 469.8 grams. Now we're going to weigh the alka salsa tablets. And this weighs 18.3 grams. Now we have to weigh the balloon. That weighs 1.9 grams. And now we have to weigh all of the materials together. And this weighs 489.9 grams. Now we're going to crush the alka seltzer tablets. You have to ensure not to lose any pieces. You may also need help from an adult. Okay, now you may need help from an adult to put the alka seltzer tablets into the balloon. Also make sure to include the powdered pieces. Okay, now I have to attach the neck of the balloon to the top of the water bottle. We have to make sure, we have to make sure to not let any of the Alka-Seltzer tablets fall into the water. See how much this space. And this space, 489.6 grams. Now, it may take a while for it to come down. Alright, watch what happens. The, the carbon dioxide gas fill, fills up the balloon because it's free and it causes the balloon to expand. We also have to be very careful not to let any spill. The solid Alka Seltzer tablets. Solid alka seltzer tablets chemically react with the liquid to create a carbon dioxide gas. Now we weigh it, and it weighs 487.6 grams. You have to make sure it stops effervescing before we take off the balloon.
Now we weigh it. And this weighs 480, 483.7 grams. Now all of the carbon dioxide gas fills up the room. Thank you for watching my experiment. Using the weights that we recorded, you can calculate the amount of carbon dioxide gas that we produce in this chemical reaction.